solar eclipse grand message rising, for the collective. Grand rising. You're mourning the old you. It's been Don't fight it. Let's do a Embrace little cleanse. It. We got the solar eclipse going on. I'm hearing a huge change. 11 on my timer. I'm hearing alone time. I'm also hearing solitude. Solitude. Solar eclipse going on today. What is going on? Let's get some random messages for you. Someone you know, don't you scroll. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, what I say, solitude. Let go of control issues. Three, three on my timer. Separation. Let go of those control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. Time apart from your person is on the horizon. Four, four on my timer. I'm here. Attraction. You might be attracted to someone new or someone's attracted to you. And they're new. I'm also hearing <clears throat> the new is coming upon us. Is when I'm hearing your new person has stirred your romantic feelings. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. You're loving on yourself. You're loving on yourself. Your self-love makes you more, more romantically attractive. You're keeping an open mind regarding your solitude. 111 on a timer. Or the new. I'm also hearing this is new for somebody to be in their solitude. This is new for someone. Yeah, something, this could be the one, one, two, three on the timer. For others, I'm hearing this could be the time, the perfect time to be in your solitude. Keep an open mind, confirmation. Take what resonates. Solitude. All right, I'm hearing you got it, dude. Full house could be significant. I'm hearing fuller house could be significant. I keep hearing um, the TV show Loud House could be significant as well. The number 11 could be significant. In a situation, Queen of Wands here, Queen of Wands, someone's being bold and confident and very passionate about themselves or someone that they know. This could be your energy or someone you know. I'm also here, yeah, you could have felt betrayed in a situation with the Ten of Swords here. Could have felt betrayed, backstabbed. So it caused you to go in some type of separation. It could be a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, 211 on my timer. Yeah, I'm hearing you went in some type of solitude. Due to someone backstabbing you or betraying you. 222 on my timer. Yep, you're moving forward. You're deciding to move forward in your life, is what I'm hearing. You're letting go of the control issues. After, you might have a period where you feel like you're mourning something or someone, or you could be mourning the death of a loved one, a friend, a family member, something like that. <clears throat> I'm hearing someone could just be replaying old past events in their head that people have betrayed them, backstabbed them. Somebody could just be replaying this in their head. But I'm hearing something here is divine timing. Something is in divine timing here with the lover's card. Could be a Gemini as well. Yeah, a victory. Victorious. I'm hearing the name Victor, Vicky, Victoria. I'm hearing Victoria's Secret 311. Could be significant, Victoria's Secret, something you gotta, oh Lord, you gotta, the sun and the victory here, recognition, something that's about to make you happy, could be with the uh, emperor here, an Aries energy, as what I'm hearing, what's going on, what's going on, yeah, yeah, I'm also hearing it's time, through to doing a timer, it's time to be more vulnerable in a situation, I'm also hearing repent, repent, I'm hearing they all gonna, they all gonna see when the horn blows, when the horn blows. All right, the solar eclipse. I'm here bringing in the new. Bringing in the new. I mean, you're very intellectual. I'm hearing you're emotionally. I'm hearing emotionally intelligent. For some, butterflies could be significant. The color blue, purple, yellow. I'm also hearing the truth. Somebody wants to know the truth. They want to know the truth, why they were left out in the cold. This could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, 411 on my timer. Somebody wants to know the truth, why you left them out in the cold. This could be definitely a partnership. Somebody tried to offer someone 420 and they got the unexpected. I'm also hearing expect the unexpected. Somebody about to come offer you something. Could be a partnership. Could be a partnership with the tower Unex expect the unexpected somebody that you least expect i'm also hearing this could be a job opportunity as well don't have to be love but i'm here this could be some type of partnership job housing um school for before the timer some type of opportunity it might be small with the page of pentacles but i'm also here is something that you're going to be new at this is going to be a new place environment it might be a new person like we stated in the beginning new love 
take what resonates definitely here with the lover's card could be a love situation guys coming coming yeah i'm definitely hearing fire earth water signs pretty much all the signs are here fire water earth yep somebody might feel like that they missed an opportunity with you with the four cups here for some type of emotional fulfillment. Somebody feels like that. I'm also hearing, don't miss your opportunity. I'm hearing this is a time where the doors are closing so a new one can be opened, is what I'm hearing. One door closed so another one can open. Yeah, you're gonna be going in hermit mode or your advice is to go in hermit mode and just stack is what I'm hearing. Stack, I'm hearing stacks. Stacks, stack, I'm hearing Jenga. I'm hearing giant Jenga, 555 on time. I'm definitely going to change. Time for a change. Something's about to be illuminated during this eclipse. That's what I'm hearing. The number 14 and number 18 could be significant. 16 could be significant. Take what resonates. I'm hearing 3 o'clock. I'm hearing 2, 2 to 5 o'clock. But... Two to five o'clock. I'm also hearing you're spiritually uh, inclined as well. I'm also hearing your spiritual gifts are going to be um, enhanced, enhanced, developing as well. An offer because you're resilient with the seven of wands. All your resilience. I'm hearing your hard work is about to pay off. I'm hearing God's plan. God's plan. Three of wands. God's plan. That's what I'm hearing. You have all the tools you need to be successful as above, so below. As above, so below. Take what resonates for you. Let's get some uh, affirmations. We got decisions. Decisions here. Making decisions. Yeah, I'm hearing get out in nature. Bluebirds could be significant. Jaybirds, redbirds. I'm hearing red robin. Red robin. <laughs> Adventure. Staying at 7 Eleven. Staying optimistic, positive. All right, somebody here is about to make some type of difficult decision here. I'm also hearing somebody is considering all their um, options. I'm hearing they're choosing carefully. Somebody is at peace with the fact that, that they know that all the decisions that they make will bring the ideal outcome. That's what I'm hearing. A let go of control issue. Something here that you made a decision on might not be the best decision for you or vice versa. It might be the best decision that you've made. I'm hearing the best decision you made yet. Take a resonate nature here. We got blue birds here. I'm hearing you are one with nature today. You appreciate nature at every opportunity. Take a resonates positivity. Again, this is somebody here alone. You might have to be on this journey alone for a while. I'm hearing that's okay too. If you are paired, that's okay too. I'm hearing I am good at what I do. I mean, you are good at what you do. You are in control of your own success and happiness. You are in control. You, collective. I'm hearing you're very adventurous as well. You're open to all the new experiences life have to offer you. Life have to offer you. I'm also hearing an altar. I'm hearing water. Water, the altar. Put water on the altar. Take what resonates. I'm hearing I will not be controlled by my routine. You will not be controlled by your routine. Hmm. I'm hearing closed. Closed. Clothes or clothes, like clothing. Yes, something about clothing. Clothing, I'm hearing robe up. Robe up, yes, no need to worry. I mean, you've done the work, my girl, my guy. You've done the work. You've done what you were supposed to. You're trusting in divine timing. You're trusting in the divine, in the near future. In the near future, I'm seeing all signs here, 9-11. You're trusting, you're getting more information. You're getting more information on this situation. You're gonna have healthy people to help you reconsider a situation. Again, this reminds me of our King of Swords. Somebody wants the truth. The truth. You're listening to your intuition, your gut feeling. I'm hearing the power of discernment. The power of discernment. You listen to your gut feeling about a situation, person, place, thing. Take what resonates. Confirmation here. I'm hearing Cupid's arrow. Cupid's arrow, you having faith that love is coming in, some type of surprise invitation, you might be hesitant to take this offer, but I'm hearing time, it's time, it's your time, sis, it's your time, bro, is what I'm hearing, you're gonna have hella options, hella options, is what I'm hearing, 
You're being lighthearted. You got this.